we're going to be talking about anxiety and relationships. Anxiety can have a big impact on our romantic relationships, friendships, and family dynamics. It can be challenging to navigate, but there are strategies we can use to communicate with our loved ones about anxiety and support them through their struggles. First, let's talk about how anxiety can impact our relationships. As Christians, we know that God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a sound mind. 2 Timothy chapter 1 verse 7. However, anxiety can cause us to feel insecure, jealous, or needy. We might worry that our partner or friends will leave us, or that they don't really care about us. These feelings can lead to arguments, misunderstandings, and even breakups. So, how can we communicate with our loved ones about anxiety? The first step is, to be honest, and open about our feelings. We can explain to our partners or friends that we're struggling with anxiety and that we need their support and understanding. We can also pray together and ask God for his guidance and peace. It's important to remember that our loved ones might not fully understand what we're going through. They might not know how to help us or what to say. That's why it's important to be patient and to educate them about anxiety. We can share Bible verses that remind us of God's love and faithfulness, and we can pray together for strength and healing. Another strategy is to set boundaries. We might need to take breaks from social situations or avoid triggers that make our anxiety worse. It's okay to say no to things we're uncomfortable with and ask for space when we need it. We can also seek professional help if needed, and trust that God will provide the resources we need for healing. Finally, let's talk about how we can support someone who is struggling with anxiety. The most important thing is to listen and to be there for them. We can offer words of encouragement, remind them of God's promises, and pray with them for peace and healing. We can also help them find resources for professional help if needed, and trust that God will guide them on their journey. We can find comfort and strength in our faith. By communicating openly and honestly with our loved ones, setting boundaries, and offering support through prayer and encouragement, we can navigate anxiety together with God's help. Remember, cast all your anxiety on him because he cares for you, 1 Peter chapter 5 verse 7. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.